位朋友，大家好，我係 Michelle 朱曼舒，歡迎大家收聽我哋今日嘅嘉賓訪談嘅。咁喺度咧，再次同大家拜個年，祝大家喺新嘅一年身體健康，萬事勝意。嗱，咁講到我哋咧係過農曆年咧，咁我哋華人咧喺加拿大啊個影響力咧真係越嚟越大㗎。咁我哋都知道咧 ，Canada Post 加拿大郵政局咧，每年咧佢哋嘅郵票咧都會出產一啲係特別咧慶祝我哋農曆新年嘅一啲新嘅郵票嘅喎。咁今日咧我哋好開心咧係請到咗 Canada Post 嘅負責人啦，就係 Danny 上嚟咧接受我哋嘅訪問，同我哋介紹一啲咧羊年。嘅新嘅郵票啦 ，Danny， 係 ，Welcome to our show。恭喜發財，恭喜發財 ，Yes， Happy Chinese New Year、uh,。啊 ，Danny， Yeah， so it's really nice， you know， uh， Canada Post produced some products to celebrate Chinese New Year。Yes。Yeah， so can you tell us about it？ Sure。Well， we have through our stamp program， we have a number of individuals that we look at that we celebrate through the year up to twenty different types of scenarios。And the Lunar New Year has always been a popular one with Canada Post, and therefore that's the one that we continue to run with this year. 嗯，其實咧就係 Canada Post 咧，咁佢哋咧每次都會揀一啲誒比較有特別意義嘅一啲嘅啊事件啊，或者係一啲傳統文化一啲事件嚟到去製作一啲新嘅郵票嘅。咁佢哋覺得咧就我哋誒中國人嘅農曆年啊，非常之有意義啦，亦都有啲嘅文化嘅色彩啊。所以咧每年咧佢哋都會係啊製作一啲嘅誒出產一啲新嘅我哋農曆新年嘅郵票嘅。So Danny, so how long has this how long has Canada Post produced this series? Well, actually, this is the second of a 12-year cycle series we're doing. So, actually, this is the seventh year of the second cycle. So, if you add it all up, we're looking at probably approximately 17th year right now. Eighteen, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Actually, so we have already, ah, originally, the Canada Post has been doing this for the past eight years. Eight, nine, 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 Um, people who are inspirational leaders. It also involves heritage and culture. Mm -hmm. um, and when we look at the Chinese community, they make a big part of the cultural mosaic of Canada mm -hmm. and a very important part of contribution to Canada as a whole, even historically. So as a result, when we're celebrating the Lunar New Year, we look at it as we're honoring the Chinese community. So therefore, the Chinese community is something that we're honoring through the program. Mm -hmm. Canada郵政局,他每年都會出產一些新的郵票 so Danny, so uh, it's really nice you bring so yes. many products to show us. Can you introduce uh, the new stamp to us? Absolutely. So yeah. we do have a number of products. Products. Sure. I'll go through a few for you. Okay. Um, the idea right now is just to show you on this yeah. one. If we look at it this way, oh, this way. there's okay. actually <laughs> two stamps that yeah. we've actually done. We've done a domestic stamp, which is the mm -hmm. image right here that you see on the pane of stamps. Yeah. Uh, on the domestic image stamp, it's what we call a P stamp. So it's a permanent stamp, and what that mm -hmm. means is. For the price that you purchase it today, whether you to do a mailing this year or next year or five years from now, you've already prepaid the price, so the price will never go up for you as a consumer. Oh, that's great. <laughs> so that's a good feature. Yeah. Um, also, with that specific design, we actually have three RAMs that are all mm -hmm. looking in different areas. And if you look over here, just a larger image of that stamp, we yeah. actually have with inspiration when that design was done, is what they refer to as a inspiration, the Dangsha Mountains in China is inspiration for that design. It mm -hmm. also features in the backdrop plum blossoms on a tree. So mm -hmm. that would be the domestic stamp. The other stamp that we have that commonly came out is what we refer to as the international stamp. Yeah. And in this case, we have the ram, and the ram in this case is looking outwards. So what they refer to is looking forward to the new year that's coming about. Mm -hmm. And then that, again, is a stamp that's available through Canada Post for international mailings anywhere in the world. Wow, it's quite meaningful, eh? <laughs> yes, no, there's a lot of meaning into it. A <laughs>、yes. um, lot of great design、mm -hmm. in terms of color as well. As you know, it's a lot of red is used traditionally. Every year, as we know, you know、mm. the color of red is very big in the Chinese celebration.、Um, and then, if you look at it as a larger shot, what we do have with some of the product is we've come out with frame prints of the product. So、yep. in this case, this is actual frame print version of both stamps, the souvenir、mm -hmm. sheet、mm. and the pane of stamps that we can also buy,、uh, purchase individually. In this case, you're looking at a.
price point of $59.95, and this can be purchased already pre-framed for you. Okay,那我們也可以介紹這些郵票 Domestic 那些年份的票是不是的 so this one too is probably a lot for collectors and really I've seen it a lot within the Chinese community. One of the events we had this past weekend. Mm -hmm. This is what we refer to as official first day cover. So the way the actual stamp design, this one being the souvenir sheet, yeah. is actually imprinted on an envelope for collectors. Mm -hmm. The nice thing about this is traditionally you'll find a lot of these envelopes are sealed when they're purchased at any mm -hmm. Canada Post office. But yeah. in this case, what we did think about in the design is it's actually left open. So therefore, if you're thinking of that lucky envelope and someone in your family red or relatives. Pocket. <laughs> yes, the red pocket. So actually with this one, you can actually put money in it or any type of little gift that you want to give to anyone, seal it up, and then you provide it for a Chinese yeah, New Year. Yeah, it's a very good gift. Yeah. 其實我剛才看到如果喜歡節日的朋友也看到這些其實就是一些有賣郵票 also we can see this is the uh, the coins, can you introduce it? Sure, yeah, well, there's a numerous coins. Some of the products we also do sell, yeah. and uh, people aren't always familiar with this. They're from the Royal yeah. Canadian Mint, and we're an authorized dealer for the Royal Canadian Mint. What mm -hmm. we have here is the Lunar uh, Year of the Ram version coin, and this one is a $15 coin, and as a collector piece, it actually sells for $98.88. Mm -hmm. There's only a mintage in this case of 18,888 produced. Mm -hmm. Each wow. one has a limited run on it in terms of a number. So each one uh -huh. is individually numbered. And for a lot of collectors, what they like about that is it's as an investment piece as well. Mm -hmm. Something you might hand down to family members or any mm -hmm. friends, and it actually can go up in value. Mm -hmm. And similar to that, we also have another coin that was designed by a local Toronto designer named Aries Chung. And in this case, again, a $15 coin, it's retailing for $98.88. Mm -hmm. And that one also, similar mintage of 18888 were produced. Each one is individually okay. numbered as a collectible piece as well. Wow, it's a really lucky number, right? Yes. 18,888. Yes, lots of eights, <laughs> lots of eights, but always lucky in the Chinese community. Yeah. Well. Okay, so we're very proud of the Chinese culture. Of course, it's a very high number of 
售賣嘅價錢咧就係九十八蚊左右啦。咁其實連埋税㗎啦。咁啊，同埋頭先呢一個都一樣啊，出產咧就係一萬八千八百八十八個嘅，咁都係限量版啦。咁如果大家要買咧，要快啲啦。咁啊，亦都非常之有呢個收藏嘅價值嘅。And how about this one? This one? And so with that one similar, just to point out, also they're all. 99.9% fine silver in the production of those coins.、Yeah. This one, the mintage on it is a little less. So again, lucky eights. It's 8,888 that were produced, <laughs> but it's a little、uh, less expensive price point as well. That I believe it's at $74.95.、Mm -hmm. And the nice thing about this one, as a feature, it's a $5 coin, is the coloring on it as well.、Yep. So something a little bit more unique. The artistic design and coloring is something that you might not find with a lot of coins that are provided to the mint, and again, available at all Canada Post dealers. Yep. <laughs> 咁呢一個咧，佢嘅限量版出售咧，就係佢係有八千八百八十八個嘅。咁佢特別嘅地方咧，就咁佢有啲顏色啦，咁同埋咧佢價錢係平啲嘅，係誒七十四蚊九毫九嘅啫。咁啊頭先咧，我哋都睇到啲 coin 咧，全部都係用呢個 ninety nine percent silver。Yes, ninety nine point nine percent silver the content。咁其實咧係用呢個誒真銀嚟到製造㗎，咁所以咧係非常之靚嘅 product 啦，同埋有呢個收藏嘅價值嘅。And how about、uh, so that one?、Yeah. So no, nice to point that out. So, this yeah, one too. We have a lot that's popular、yeah. is what they call the、mm -hmm. uncut sheet, and this is actually an uncut sheet. But in this case, you can buy it separately, and、yeah. you can have it framed yourself. But what we've done as well is provided you with a frame print、mm -hmm. already set up for you. So、mm -hmm. it's not only is it already framed, but what comes with yeah, it. Yeah, you can just、uh, put it on the floor, and then the、okay. camera will see it. Yeah. Is、okay. is actual yeah.、Um, yeah. individually signed. So what you have here. Is not only the design or signature of the designer.、Mm -hmm. It also has the illustrator on there, both by Helen Lehero、yeah. and also the illustrator Susan Scott. But、mm -hmm. it also includes the calligrapher and their design in there as well.、Oh. So you've got three people who are involved in design, all personally signed this with a limited print run of only 700. So they're all individually numbered of one of 700 on the print.、Mm -hmm. These retail for a little bit more at $150, but considering the collectability because of the signature. Already on the item and the limited run of it makes it actually a very great value. And again, that's something that's available at all Canada Post outlets for、uh, purchase. Yeah. 咁咧，其實咧呢啲咧亦都係即係 Canada Post 啊，就係將誒呢啲郵票頭先我哋都見到咧，出產咗好多唔同嘅誒雙咗唔同嘅形式啦。好似而家我哋見到嘅熒光幕呢一個咧，就係啊呢一個郵票咧，佢就雙咗一個 frame 啦。咁同埋咧下邊仲有三個嘅 designer 嘅。So where can people、uh, buy this kind of product? Sure. So with all these products that we've seen, they're available at any Canada Post outlet available across coast to coast. Um, if we don't actually have the product, one nice feature that Canada Post does have is what we refer to as direct ship.、Mm -hmm. So, therefore, you come into our post office. If the item isn't available, we can look it up for you, and you can ship it anywhere to any address in Canada. Okay. Thank you so much, Danny. So, I hope、uh, our audience will,、uh, you know, like this all kind of、uh, stands and、uh, have a really happy Chinese New Year.、Great. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.